Hello, banjo lovers. Let's talk about banjo. Got this one. Last week, great price, great value. Anyway, uh, you can uh, get my uh, watch my other videos talk about this banjo. Okay, and let's talk about the fretboard. Okay, the banjo core. Okay, based on actually based on Open G tuning. Okay, uh, if you know guitar, okay, if you play guitar, all right, the banjo chord and fretboard is very easy, actually, all right, and uh, look, okay, guitar six strings, okay, if you know guitar, you know lots of instrument fretboard, okay, like uh, uh, ukulele, mandolin, and the banjo, okay, they are actually less strings than guitar, all right, so if you know guitar, you can play those instrument uh, quite easy okay pick up very easy all right so open G for uh, banjo is first string is D second string is B third string is G and the fourth string is D let's forget about the G string the top one okay the thin one all right actually if you compare to guitars actually everything's same everything's the same second string third string and fourth string exactly like guitars second third and fourth string only difference is the fourth string okay guitar standard tuning two to the e and the open g tuning for banjo is d okay what does that mean all right that means every chord okay let's talk about the chord okay you fret like a guitar exactly okay and then you move okay you move if there's a uh, everything okay for the fourth string you have to move up to two frets okay up to two frets for example right I have a minor okay a minor like first fret on second string and uh, second fret on third and fourth string on guitar same like a banjo okay but what about first string first string open open string on guitar is E this one's D then I, we have to fret second string i mean second fret on the first string for banjo then they make a minor chord okay and then if there's a close chord okay then you can move up to the fretboard for the uh, banjo up one is a a minor a sharp minor and b minor c minor okay and d minor it's just it's move okay it's movable Okay, and then another chord like a C, right? We we fret C like in guitar exactly uh, first fret on second string, and uh, like this, right? Right. Let's say this way, right? Like this way, right? Is it like that? Yeah. So anyway, so yeah. So and then like this. Sorry, <laughs> like this. Okay, first fret on second string and the third string is uh, open and the uh, fourth string is second uh, fret and the, the fourth string is uh, for guitar it's open it's E okay for banjo is D so what should we do okay we fret two frets okay frets uh, higher than the guitar and then we use uh, this finger this your small finger to fret this Second fret on first string. That makes C chord. See? Exactly the same thing. Right? What about D? In D we fret guitar like this. Right? Like this. And uh, like this, like this. Okay. And then in this time in this time, the banjo we fret on the second uh, second fret on the first string. Okay. And then the guitar, this this shape is guitar, right? So what we have to do for banjo, we move the first string this second fret up to two frets then we have to do this shape right this is this, this shape that means we use a small finger press this uh, fourth fret and the other all other finger are the same you can use this finger and use that finger all right and then you can move it okay, okay. make adjustment for fourth string okay if you're smart enough all right so basically that's it okay if you know the uh, the box, okay, for example, the pentatonic box one, box two, or all, all the way to box three, around all of, all the way uh, along neck, okay, you can 
play exactly the same thing. Okay, the only thing we'll do is. Okay, only thing you do is like uh, the thing, the note. Okay, you play on the fourth string. You have to move up to two frets. That's all you need to do.